Hey guys, how you doing? We are doing another uh, unbagging, I guess, uh, for this video. We are doing this product right here. This is the um, Subtempo Snow Chains 6 Set Emergency Anti-Slip Tire Chains with an upgraded TPU car snow chain for trucks, minivan, pickup, all of that stuff, right? And this one goes for uh, forty-three dollars and ninety-nine cents, right there. I'm trying to see if this can, uh, you guys can see that one forty-three ninety-nine. It's a little blurry right now. Sorry for that one. All right, so this is it right here. Comes up to this. Uh, doing a trip up to the mountains uh, in the winter. So this is what we're doing. All right, so it comes with some gloves uh, that you can work with uh, to protect your uh, hands from the chains and all that. And also if you're working with snow and it comes with this baby right here, which is a scraper, which is uh, very, very great for, I guess you could use this for your windshield also. Um, and uh, yeah, so that's pretty cool. And then these are the chains. Now these are not your regular chains because I've, I've never really uh, seen these things uh, before. But um, if you look uh, online on Amazon, see like that's how it fits. So these things right here are the ones that hold uh, the these little round metallic things on the bottom of the plastic and that's what goes on to your tires and that's what holds on to the uh, road and then these sides right here these prevent uh, uh, for the, the, the this the buckles onto your tire so it kind of makes sure that it's uh, it doesn't come off so let's see what's in here so it comes with one, two, three, four, five, and six, um, which is what they stated. Now, here's the thing. I bought two sets of these because when I'm looking at the photo right here, it's it seems like you're gonna put one, two, and three. Your regular chains, they just kind of like go around your whole entire tire. This one, it's just going on certain parts of your tire, kind of like a triangle. So uh, when you have six pairs of these, that means they can only go to two different tires, which is your front or your back tires, usually for your front. So I bought two so that I could have all four tires with chains right there. So that's how they would fit in. And now we just, I just wanna test this out right here. And I just kinda wanna show you guys also I actually, I just opened this as you guys have seen, so I'm not sure how these things actually work. Um, I did see in uh, the instruction that you do have to um, use, you do have to use uh, a tool for this one. Let me see if I could find that one. There's a photo right here. And if you can see, there's like, um, if you can see that uh, they're using a tool. And I definitely do not see that tool here. It doesn't come with that tool. Um, so that uh, is for the lock. So yeah, so you definitely need uh, that one right there, a wrench. Um, and it shows you right here how to do it. So I'm gonna read this real quick and see if I can figure it out. All right, you guys. So um, there is an instructional video that comes with it. And look what I found. So right at, at the page, which I will uh, put a link to this product um, below. Um, this video uh, there is on that link uh, there's these photos and at the bottom you will see a video that will teach you how to do this but I will show you guys how to do this uh, real quickly this one actually it came it did came with a wrench it did came with a wrench it was underneath the whole entire thing and I couldn't really see it but that's good it comes with it so um, here's what you do so um, you're gonna rotate the, this to the point where you can kind of uh, put this through the first hole here so you can see there's a hole right there and then there's another hole on the other side and you kind of just like put this through just like so right and then once it's through 
obviously this goes onto your tires first, right? So this would go onto your tire, this would hug onto your tire, and you would put these through uh, the middle of your tire from the back and all the way to the front. And then you would meet around and then do this right here, which I just did earlier. And you're gonna pull this out on the other side, just like so. And then once it's out like that, all you gotta do is you're gonna use this wrench and you're just gonna rotate this and you're gonna get it as tight as you can with your tires, right? And then once it gets tight enough, you know, you'll have that hold right there. It's actually pretty good. You definitely wanna make sure um, that you do it uh, really, really tight so it doesn't slip off your tires. So that's what it is. And then these would go on to the bottom of your tires right there, right? And this would provide the traction. Now, to get this off your tires, all you got to do is right over here on the side, you see this little thing right here. They said to use your wrench. They don't really show you how to do it. Um, I don't know how to do it. Um, it's actually kind of harder to use the wrench, but it is safer, I guess, uh, if you push it like that, because this is the one that's holding the teeth of the thing that rotates it and that's what locks it. But let me just show you with my hand right here, but I don't suggest you guys doing this one, um, is you would do this right there. You would pull it, pull it outwards, right? So you'd pull this outwards. And as you do that, once once you do this one, once you pull it outwards, you're just gonna pull uh, this one out of the way. And it's both sides right there, right? There's two sides of them. So I guess, I don't know if you use this side maybe um yeah i i really don't know how to use uh this one with the wrench but you definitely have to undo uh both sides right here i'm just using my hands and then once you do that these things will freely turn and then you'll be able to uh pull it out um a lot easier and then you can just you know push this out just like what what we did earlier um in the video but Yep, there, again, there's two sides of this one. It is def definitely a little um, difficult that I'm using my hands, uh, but I just didn't know how to use the, the wrench on this one. But as you can see, uh, that's how you do it. And that's what that is. Again, this is for $43.99 on Amazon. You guys see it. I'm not sure how it is really. I gotta actually use it on the snow. Um, which is not till January. So, um, January 2020, if you guys have any questions, uh, by then I should have some answers about like how it does with, uh, in the snow, the traction and everything. So let me know, comment below. Um, otherwise, happy buying.